I had been a CEO and founder of a medical service that from the very beginning, 32 years ago, was both price and quality transparent. I, seven years ago, had three people come into my life in the same month that didn't come to me just to find access to healthcare to solve a significant problem. Instead, they came in seek of financial assistance. Each one of them had very good jobs, as well as health insurance, and yet they faced financial devastating ruin from medical bills they never expected they'd have to pay. All of us as American workers and employers are purchasers of health coverage or insurance. And yet, we've been blind to no prices. We've been blindsided by outrageously overcharged medical bills. In no other sector do we not know prices or have to pay with a blank check. Only healthcare, without price transparency, without the ability to lower our cost of care and get better quality of care. Our American healthcare system is doing egregious harm to the American businesses, our public sector, and to the American worker and their families. So I went to Washington. This is the moment in time where I know philanthropically where I needed to focus and spend my time and build an A-team. And we found four existing laws that had just been sitting on the shelf collecting dust, giving us all the rights to know all the prices in healthcare before we get care. Those were big wins for the American people. Since January 1st, 2021, we have the right to have all hospitals present all of their actual prices and negotiated rates by every insurance carrier and every health plan, as well as the discounted cash prices. We have thousands of patients that come into us with their stories. And these are hardworking people with jobs with coverage that have been financially ruined. It is the individual patients and the harm that they are experiencing from our healthcare system that's putting them and their families into financial ruin. That keeps us motivated to keep fighting the fight. It is a huge honor to uh, receive this award and recognition from the Alliance. I have great respect for the organization and the members of the organization who are seeking to lower the cost of health care and provide the best care they can for all of their members' covered lives.